In this uh, training, we're going to talk about MLAG, or Multi-Chassis Link Aggregation Group. Uh, MLAG is, in a sense, having um, two switches appear to be one. Um, and via a peer link, they are able to exchange information, which keeps track of the link aggregation packets, the packets that are traveling across the link aggregation. What you're kind of used to is that, um, you know, you could create a lag, either LACP or something else, going between two different switches. In this case, we're splitting and creating redundancy. So it deploys lag technology to different member ports on a pair of devices, which appear to be a, on a single device to the downstream third device. So to configure MLAG, there uh, is about seven steps. Uh, so first of all, we're going to configure VLAN and the VLAN interface. So refer to the other training videos to uh, learn how to create a VLAN and a VLAN interface. We're going to configure uh, a lag interface and add ports to that lag. We're going to um, verify that we have IP connectivity, layer 3 connectivity between the two peers over the peer link. We're going to configure the MLAG domain, the MLAG node, and the peer link. And we're going to uh, show you how to verify that um, you have configuration consistency and um, and we're going to configure a link ID on the MLAG member port and then show that MLAG link to verify that the MLAG port is OK. So our first step, I'll go ahead and move this out of the way and show you. Uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to configure a, 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 a peer link interface. In this case, uh, we've already done this on a um, on one of our switches. This is. Uh, now this is one member of the uh, MLAG peer. So we're going to show you VLAN 4094. We went ahead and created an aggregate Ethernet, AE36, which has multiple links between our two devices. The other end of the peer is uh, going to be at this IP address. So our IP address is more than likely um, 13.9 or 11. And the other end is 13.10. That is our peer across the peer VLAN of 4094. And you can see that we've set an L3 interface on that as well. Yeah, so verified, if we just kind of look down through this, here's the peer link. That's the link on the other um, member of the MLAG peer. And here is our IP address, 13.9, 13.10 is the other side. So in order to configure, or rather in order to uh, verify that our peer link is set up properly, we're going to ping the other side. So we're going to ping dot 10, and indeed it comes back um, successful. The other piece we're going to verify, uh, actually we're going to do another configuration command. The configuration command that we're doing is um, one of the MLAG commands. It's uh, set protocols MLAG, so we're going to look for protocols. Or that's, actually, let's just look for MLAG domain. And so the next command we run is set protocols MLAG domain. We're going to assign a domain ID to it. And we're going to tell it whether or not we are the um, A side or B side. So there's two uh, switches that are involved in MLAG. This side is node 0. The other side is going to be node 1. Then we go about assigning our peer IP addresses. So we're going to tell it that um, over VLAN 4094, Using peer link AE36, this is the IP address at the other end. 